guys. We are back on Buzz Chum. Make sure you're subscribed. Thank you. Oh yeah. The Walking Dead, kids. Last season we had done a whole vlog about Jesus and how he's gonna save Alexandria and be a link. We're pushing that out there even farther now that Jesus is our link to everything and Jesus is gonna help Alexandria, the hilltop, and the kingdom all come together and battle against Negan. Jesus is our catalyst, our savior, our person for hope who is going to save everyone. Jesus obviously does not have faith in Gregory, the leader of the hilltop. We'll just put it out there that we friggin hate, hate Gregory. We've said it before, we've read the comic, so we know Gregory's freight and he sucks. And so far, he sucks in the TV show and they're totally, totally setting it up that Gregory will not be the leader of the Hilltop that much longer. And we love that, we totally agree with that. It's Jesus as the catalyst in the comics who pushes the Hilltop to actually fight against Negan, to actually turn their fear into a strength. And that's really what we see him doing here in the TV show too. Jesus has hope and faith in Maggie and we friggin' love this. Okay, this episode was good. It wasn't the best episode of the season. The Walking Dead has a formula. It sets it up, it has slow points and it's just the way it is. But we like it that Jesus has all this faith in Maggie. I mean, poor Maggie, this is the first time we've seen her since Glenn's attack. The fact that they have that little like, small exchange, it was just a small little exchange where he kind of tells her that he doesn't have faith in Gregory. She asks him who else he would want to lead and he goes, oh, we'll talk about that another time. Yeah, because he wants her to lead the hilltop, yep. Maggie to lead the hilltop, which we think would be absolutely fabulous. And honestly, we think that that's where the show is going. It's pretty evident that that's where the show is going. Maggie has been such a strong force. I mean, even Rick had been pushing her to lead, like she did all the negotiations with Gregory last season and all of that. So back to the point that Jesus knows everybody. Gregory already says it that, oh, what, Jesus, you wanna lead? Oh, you'll have to be here more than like a minute and not go off and run around all over the place. Well, Jesus is an explorer, he's out there. He knows his way around this world. He knows everything that's out there. So even though we haven't seen him interact with the kingdom yet, we just know that he knows them, guys. We just know that he does. It's not just the hilltop, it's not just the saviors, but it's the kingdom too and we know that Jesus knows that they have problems with Negan too, that it's not just them and that the kingdom has a lot of men. They have a lot of people. Before all groups coming together, you need a catalyst, you need a savior, you need someone that's bringing hope and that is definitely, definitely Jesus. That's what this slow showing everyone is doing. That's what the walking dead is doing. They're setting it up. They're dropping hints, they're dropping pieces, they're showing you Jesus, and they're showing you that Jesus really has a hand in everyone. He can relate to people. It's the same thing like he gets in the truck at the end and we see Carl friggin' going to the Savior, is gonna try to kill Negan, go Carl, and Jesus is gonna be there to have Carl's back. He's just like that type of person, he just relates to people. I think he reads people well. I think he's able to connect with people because he's just like a good person. The Walking Dead is building, kids. I know it's building slow. Stick it out. We know what happens in the comics and it looks like we're on full course for a full Hilltop Alexandria Kingdom battle against Negan. Yep, they're gonna get their revenge and Jesus is gonna be there. He's gonna be leading the charge. He's gonna be bringing everyone together he's going to be putting maggie at the head of hilltop and getting everyone together and getting negan out of power yeah kids yeah comment below let me know what you think about jesus and having hope and being our little savior against negan yeah kids yeah the walking dead kids 
tune back in. More from Mandy and Dan on Buzz Chill. Subscribe. Oh yeah, thank you. Mm -hmm.